Hi there, this is a short video to show you how to change images on your Revolution slider. So um, when you log into the back end of your website, you'll come through to the menu on the left hand side here and click on Revolution slider. Then this is your homepage slider here, you'd click to edit slides. I find it easier to just edit existing slides than to necessarily create new ones. So let's say that you wanted to change this image here. You would click on Edit Slide. Now there are two things that you would potentially want to do. Change the image and then change the link to, the, um, uh, to where the, the slide would go. If you scroll down here to change the image, you would just click on this blue button here. Click on Change Image. And if you'd already uploaded the image, you would select it here, or you would click on Upload File. In, with regards to image size, um, I find that the easiest image size to use is um, 1920 pixels by 740 pixels. So that's 1920 by 740. So you would then select the image that you want to use and click on Insert. And that would then um, change the image on the slide. If you wanted to change the link, so if, you're, um, if you want somebody to be able to click on the slider and download a PDF or click to another point in your website, you would come to this section here that says Enable Link, and you would enable a link, leave the link type as regular, and then add in the... Um, the window, so a link on the, put in your URL here. So if you were linking to a PDF, you would have uploaded the PDF first and then copy the URL of the PDF document and then always try and link it in a new window. Um, and once you've done all of that, you just have to click at the bottom, go update slide. The other thing that um, potentially you might want to do is to edit the layers on a slide. So um, if you have wording over a slide, you would then click over here um, and it would bring up, if you had text over the slide, you would see that text here and you would be able to edit the text. This slide is just an image, so that happens when you have a another layer with text over the slide. The other thing that you may want to do is to change the order of the slides. That's very simple. You just come up to the top here, mouse over so that you get the directional arrow, and you literally just move the slide to the position that you want it. Alternatively, what you can also do, if we click back onto the home uh, section of Revolution Slider, if you click on Edit Slides again and you get here, you can also shift these up and down to be able to change the order. Um, and then, um, as soon as you've done that, it will then um, ask you to save settings, which you then do. So that is the easiest way to be able to work with Revolution Slider.